What up, y'all? It's the answer. We back with another one. With all this YSL case development, what may get lost in the shuffle is Rich Homie Quan and his separation from YSL a few years back. He's been popping up on Math Hoffa, other platforms, and what we're going to talk about today is what would have happened if he stuck around? Was it great that he got away? And the case with OG Nut that kind of prompted all of this to be ramped up. Let's get to it. See, whack, I was paying attention to um some of that case, you know, some of the shit in the case, because you know it was hours of footage. We couldn't really listen to all of it. Man, the, the lead detective in the case said he really turned it up on him when he found out that that car was rented in his name, the one that um allegedly the one that was in that nut that's the when one they, they turned up. On. yeah but yeah, then he yeah, just yeah. told and said he was yep. with him when he rented the car yep that's and what he told on and said he was with yep. him when thug got the car and then when he showed up to the condo to get his bag yep that's i did not know them had been told they've been told they've been like told they've been told bro they've yeah. been told um, these, oh, these, oh, uh, Boy, <clears throat> well, I do not. Boy, these I be telling you, boy, these will tell on you and be working. It's a working, bro. Been out here working 10, 15 years, bro. Like on some real, pay attention to these. I got a long run doing some that everybody else get caught doing every other year. You chilling with the answer? I heard it. Um, that guy, uh, Peanut, was uh, Rich Homie Kwan's manager. The one that started YSL. He wasn't in his official manager, but you know he was the he was definitely a reason that he got signed to TIG and, and got good manager. He was also cool with Lucci. Yeah, he Fine. no, he was definitely cool with Lucci. He's definitely that. Yeah, he 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 like he like Lucci. Him and Lucci, older brothers, like best friends or something like that. Definitely cool um, with Lucci. Y'all be knowing all these. Nah, I mean, I broke it down last night. I was watching it. Nah, I've been seeing Ritual McQuan a lot, you know, ever since Thug, you know what I'm saying, got it, you know, in the cell, but... Always fought, I used to always see that what hindered Rich Homie Kwan career was him separating from Thug, but it looked like it was one of the smartest things he could have did. What's that? I felt like, I felt like, I felt like he would have been bigger. If no, he, he would have been caught. He would have been caught right the fuck up, though. Yeah, that's a fact. That's a fact. Yep. <laughs> that's would have been caught up. Yeah. The thing, that, that's, that's what I'm saying. The thing is that they started looking at them since um, those, those days, which, which, which homie Kwan and Peanut, like, well, no, whatever his name is, when you started well, yeah. managing... Yeah, I don't know what well, you what mean, it was, was that. nut nut um bird stunner wanted to sign Rich on McCorn when they did the Rich game. Stunner wanted to, to sign Rich on McCorn. And what they saying is nut didn't want to let Rich Homer sign and that's when that started some tension. Because they all was cool. Doug was cool with um with nut too. I know one thing. I'm gonna tell you what you need to start doing. Is um they need to change these names up. You gotta change everything up. No C no young thug. Nah, but like you gotta really no you gotta really start beating them at their own game. Since they using social media and all this old topic. Let's say if it's ten of us called to um, you know, the quad. Man, they the nah, <laughs> man, we denounce all that. Listen, we are not no squad. We letting y'all know right now. We denounce that. That ain't what we are. You know what I mean? That ain't what we represent. That ain't you got to start denouncing all that. So when they want to use other shit on you in court, your defense got the other. Hey, they made these changes four years ago, right? Y'all can still be who you are for real, but that shit better be in the shadows. You better not. You better stop doing that shit in the light. They are classifying tax ID numbers, corporations, as organizations. You chilling with the answer? The jig is up. Oh, you. Then learn how to open up corporations. Watch this. That's why I, I tilt my head to them young in Baton Rouge, man. That was, that was that was a good look right now, bro. Young Bond and Fredo. Yeah, they stay solid. So the jig is up. Appreciate y'all tuning in. Y'all missed that rich gang, man. They had something going there. It's a shame that went left. But um it was a blessing in disguise for him to get away from that. He would have definitely got swept up. And the push and plea campaign would have hit him too. But anyway, man, 
If there's any updates on the case or anything else, we'll be sure to bring it to you. Like, comment, subscribe. It's your boy, The Answer. Catch me on Clubhouse, man. And I appreciate all the support. We out till next time.